In this lab, the materials needed are a meter stick, a board, a candle, matches, and a lens. The aim of this lab is to find the focal length of a convex lens. The first step on this lab is to light up the candle. This lab is to be done with the lights off. Place the board at a reasonable distance away from the candle and place the lens at an area where the image is most clearly reflected on the board. After getting a clear image on the board, calculate the distance from the candle to the board, which is notified as V, and from the candle to the lens, which is notified as U. Repeat this procedure to make up a total of 40 points. As you're collecting data, make sure you're recording them in Excel. You should also take into account how evenly dispersed the points are. It would be good if you have a wide range of points and nothing too consistent. After you are done collecting 40 data points, plot them in a scatter plot graph. When you finally have your scatter plot graph, print it out and draw a curve of best fit. These are the results that we got from our lab. As you can see, there is a trend in the way the data is displayed. As the number of U increases, the number for V decreases. On the graph are the 40 points we plotted. When looking at the graph, you can draw the asymptotes, which give you the focal length. The focal length is the point at which, when you put the camera, you no longer get an image on the screen. This is also the aim of the lab. Errors that could have occurred during this lab are human errors such as measuring. This could have occurred when measuring the distances from the candle to the board and from the candle to the lens.